Okay. For the next picture, bend back at your waist. 53-year-old Helen Anderson is having her breast checked for cancer. It's not a mammogram. That's the most common way to look for the disease and one that's proven to work. This self-employed translator is getting breast thermography instead. Okay, now you want to turn and face that wall. Thermography uses an infrared camera to take thermal images of the breast. Doctors look for temperature variations. They say indicate breast abnormalities. This breast is hotter. So that there's more means there's more blood flow, there's more activity in that in this breast. Which could indicate pre-cancer, according to thermography technician Leisha Getson. She says thermography can detect precancerous changes ten years before it's visible on a mammogram. I personally believe and also professionally believe that this is a wonderful alter alternative to mammography. Dr. Monica Karazani Gavin says she offers thermography to patients in her medical spa for two reasons. One, there's no radiation exposure, like with mammography, and second, because it can really pick up precancerous changes. Helen says she's concerned about the amount of radiation she's had over the years and hopes to replace her yearly mammogram with thermography. This was a breeze or a piece of cake. <laughs> There's no pressure and stretching and pulling. It's not ready for prime time yet. Breast cancer oncologist and founder of BreastCancer.org, Dr. Marissa Weiss, says the breasts are very active organs with constant heat changes that could indicate nothing. It's a really intriguing idea. But right now, thermography has, is not the standard of care. It hasn't been compared yet in a rigorous way to mammography. And she says women should not be worried about the radiation from a mammogram. You get it once a year. The mammogram machines today are better than we've ever had before. Flying in an airplane from Philly to Denver and back gives you more radiation than one annual mammogram. A major drawback to thermography is that it will not detect, pinpoint, or identify existing tumors. Dr. Karazani Gavin says women with an abnormal thermography reading should follow up with a mammogram or MRI. But she still believes that thermography is safer than mammography. I strongly believe that women should have options and they should be empowered to make their own decisions. My life is my greatest gift. I need to protect and cherish it. Getting a mammogram is part of that.